news right now out of Thailand. Rescue teams are working through the night to save 12 boys and their coach trapped inside a cave. The monsoon had come early. The conditions in the cave were impossible. There was a very strong feeling that the children couldn't be still alive. We need expert cave divers out here. The Thai Navy SEALs put everything they had into it, but only this group of people who do it as a weekend hobby has those skills. I was thinking this, this has actually got our name all over it. You couldn't see your hand in front of your face trying to wriggle through holes that I couldn't wriggle through, finding a bigger space, sliding through, and then repeating again and again. How, how many of you? Thirteen. We look into each other's faces thinking we may be the only ones that ever see them. Finding the boys was the easy part. They didn't have a clue how to get those kids up. We didn't think it was possible to dive the children out. We came up with the actual logistical plan. I told him, that's a horrible idea. And then Rick said, what if it's the only idea? We were brutally honest. We promised multiple fatalities. It's about controlling your emotions and your fear. Panic is death in the cave. My mind was on overdrive. Oh my God, am I going to be good enough? If they die, it's going to tear me apart. If you don't die, everyone will die. I told the guys, this is a one-way trip. Once you start, you cannot stop. Believe. Believe. 